Caleb Nance here from CalebNance.com. I uh, just wanted to do uh, another quick tutorial. Uh, logging into the back end. Uh, this is going to be showing you how to connect an article with um, a menu link on your front end and also um, setting up a new menu um, and then showing that menu with the module. So, not too hard uh, or extensive, but just going to show you the basics. Um, this is a really basic thing that you would need to know on your Joomla site. And um, so, I already have some articles um, on here. Uh, go to Content and Article Manager, and that's how you get to uh, articles. Basically, front page, I have it published to the front page. So, if you go to the front end, this is the front page, and this is the article that is um, published to the front page. Uh, we're going to go back to the back end and go to menus and then menu manager this is all the menus um, on this site then also you can just click this and it goes to the actual menu but we want to do a new menu so we would go back to main menu and then menu manager and then click new over here and to the right and this is uh, basically a unique name and then uh, test menu I just call them all the same. I think this is supposed to be like, uh, you know, just for the database. So um, it's kind of like the alias for an article, um, just so it's unique from all the other menus. Um, you can put a description there. And then also, uh, this go ahead and makes a module for you for this menu. So this is a pretty cool feature. Um, go ahead and save it. And so now we have another menu right here and it has no published um, uh, menu links in it as it sees here and, but it does have one module and it shows that and then you can also see the menu ID um, so we're going to go back to menus and then now we have that test menu option and as you see there's no menu links in here so we'll go to new and here is um, basically everything you can connect it to um, Jom Social I have installed here so you can connect uh, Jom Social uh, with this menu link. Let's say I want to go to the home, so I would click this right here, and it would create that link for this menu. And every time, let's say you wanted to make uh, just the menu link for the user once they're logged in, you could have this as you know profile or whatever. So once they're logged in, they can see this module and. Uh, be able to click on it and go straight to their their profile on um, Jom Social or Com Community. But we're going to go ahead and just uh, connect it to an article. Um, if you hover over each of these, you'll see you know if you wanted it to link to a category um, in the blog layout or a category in just list of all the articles in that specific category, then you can do this. But we just want to do it to a single article. So we'll click this article layout, and here is where you will put your title, alias you don't have to worry about, and then also access level public so everyone can see it. And what I was talking about earlier was the registered. Let's say if you did want to have that community, um, and once they're logged in they can see their password or uh, profile link, um, then you would hit register and they could only see that that menu if they're registered but we'll keep it public and over here we select an article this pulls up all the articles that you have on your site and I'm just gonna connect it to sample one you got parameters basically very self-explanatory you hover over each title it'll give you uh, what this does and parameters, um, you can put uh, page class suffix, uh, just nothing, this gets more into detailed stuff and I'm trying to just keep it basic, so this is really all you need to know, I mean, basic <laughs> explains it, uh, you know, so just hit save, and so now we have that menu link uh, connected to uh, articles and article, which is the sample article, and it is published. So now we'll go back to extensions and then module manager. 
and like I said, it created a um, a test menu already for me whenever I named it. And as you see, this number five, uh, it's unpublished, but it's in the left position, and it's the mod main menu. So we'll go ahead and click into this, and as you see, we'll go ahead and enable it. It's called what I named it earlier. This is where you can assign um, to what pages you want it to show up on. Go to my uh, module template tutorial and you can learn more about modules. Um, list, different styles, you know, if you want it to uh, go horizontally on your menu, let's say up, up at the top or something in position, then you would select horizontal. Um, But we're just going to keep it to list. And everything basically, I mean, seriously, it's self explanatory. Here you can select main menu if you wanted to select uh, the main menu to show on this module, but we're going to keep this test menu. So we'll save it, and now that it is enabled, it should be here when I refresh it. And it is right there. So now it's a little link, and you click on it, and bam, that's it. All right. And this is another color for my uh, test template I'm making. It's, I don't know, it's okay. I really don't like uh, the whole color scheme. I'm going to have to do a little better on that. But um, that's basically really everything you need to know about connecting an article with a menu link and publishing it on um, the module. Uh, I guess I'll show you this real fast. Another way, if you didn't create a module when you created the menu or you wanted to create a new one, you would go to Module Manager and then click New right here. This gives you a list of everything. And we would go to Menu, and bam, same thing we just had with the test menu. I uh, hope that's been beneficial to you all. Again, any questions, uh, comments, anything, go to calebmance.com and contact me on my email. Uh, and I hope you all have a great day. Thanks.